The building of a custom Sherco home starts with the designing of a house plan and the selection of lot. Once the plans are done and the lot is purchased, Sherco hires a surveyor to create a survey showing the positioning of the home in relation to property lines and setbacks. The plans and survey are used to acquire a building permit from the governing authority responsible for overseeing the permitting process for the lot location. Once the permit is issued, construction can begin. The surveyor will visit the lot and stake the home according to the survey. The survey stakes will be marked with elevations and a specific description of the stake's intent. The excavator will use the stakes as reference points to begin the dig process and prepare for foundation work. The excavator will dig to heights and elevations noted on the survey. Dirt will be moved around the site and saved for backfilling once the foundation and wall system are completed. The home shown is being constructed on a walkout lot. Upon completion of excavation, the foundation crew arrives. This home will have a poured wall system. The process starts with construction of the concrete footings. The wall contractor, using the house plans, builds forms, then pours a concrete base outlining the walls according to the plan. A truck arrives with wall forms that are transferred into the work area in metal crates with a boom. After the foundations have cured, the contractor then assembles metal wall forms to the desired wall heights on the top of the concrete footings. The metal frames are hollow and are locked together to form the foundation walls. When the entire wall system has been constructed, the walls are ready to be filled with concrete. A pumping truck with a boom arrives on the job site and is positioned within close proximity of the forms. Cement trucks will also arrive with the cement mixture. Cement from the mixers is transferred into the pumping truck. A boom operator moves the nozzle around the wall system as workers fill the forms with concrete. Once the forms are full, workers then trowel the tops of the forms to create a smooth edge. The workers work as a team, moving around the foundation until all the walls are filled. After curing, the forms are removed to expose the walls. Note the anchor bolts coming out of the concrete. A wood late will be attached and this will be the start of framing. The exterior of the walls is waterproofed. The excavator will backfill the walls and move dirt around the foundation, establishing preliminary slope and grade for the future yard. Interested in a Sherco home? Feel free to hit the Contact Us button to begin the process.